hello hello welcome back my beautiful souls it is day 21 amazing i'm just amazed um yesterday we talked about boundaries um so how did it go did you actually sit down and wrote it down did you already know what kind of boundaries you need to create um let me know i'm curious because we are all different we are in different um, parts of our journeys so um, i want to see where everybody's are because today we are doing something that is related to yesterday's topic and that is dun, 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 hard conversations because sometimes we know what kind of boundary we need to put in the place um, or if we need to end a toxic relationship or if we need to um, change something or something is bothering us sometimes you have this like small little feeling like ah, something really bother you and then it's easier for you just to not do anything about it than to have a conversation about it so that's small little feeling and something that it's like so trivial and just like so small and it can be pretty much nothing grows inside of you and grows and grows and becomes resentment and becomes like hatred and becomes so much of a hard toxic negative emotions and it's all because you didn't have a conversation about it so this is something i'm practice a lot uh, i'm practicing a lot i would just um when I realize something is off, something is bothering me, something happened, I would make an effort to talk to that person. Um, with my husband all the time, we would, like now it's so easy for us because we are both very approachable and we are both very open. Let's, let's talk about it. This is what's going on. Uh, let's say we are fighting or like not fighting like arguing constantly about the stupidest things right it's never about this small thing it's always something deeper so one of us would be okay let's okay reassess let's sit down what's going on something is going on we need to have this conversation even though it's uncomfortable and hard conversation and we are calling each other out and like building this um marriage and relationship right but it ha we need to have these conversations because if we just like turning our eyes on the other side then something like very toxic and very heavy grows in our heart same for the friendship same for the family from for anybody and you probably know who is that person you need to have a conversation with um i had many many hard conversations in my life but i would just be like all right, all right, I, I am just so kind of paralyzed from the inside, but like I, I need to do it um, because it's for my inner peace. So it's same like seeking discomfort and going out of a comfort zone. I'm going out of a comfort zone. It is having a hard, hard conversations. Um, and I'm pretty sure you all have that one person that you like, to really tell how you feel um, so I'm gonna make an effort to do that myself and you do something with somebody who is in your life uh, just for your own sake because if you don't have this conversation if you don't share what is bothering you then the only person who suffers is you because this inner um, inner small little worm of like doubt and judgment and it will eat you up you will feel resentment you will feel angry you will feel um, defensive just because you didn't talk about it you didn't brought it up and like have a conversation about it sometimes with conversation we can fix things we can work together on it sometimes we cannot sometimes we need to grow apart sometimes we need to like make boundaries um, so it's different but we need to take this step and respect ourselves enough and respect our inner peace enough so we can have these hard conversations da -da -da, and we can live a better life a more peaceful life and more loving life so that's it for today think about it i am kind of confident that you already know who is that one person you want to talk to maybe it's more than one 
Um, yeah, let me know. Let me know. Share. And I'll see you tomorrow for day 23. Thank you, my beautiful soul. I love you.